Let's get more now on the breaking news we've been telling you about a shooting at a fraternity house at the New Jersey Institute of Technology. Yes, yeah, CBS News Magdalena Doris on the scene right now in Newark with an update on the situation there. Mag? Chris and Mary, this is now a homicide investigation, and the scene is sprawling. We have been pushed back multiple times by police because they are continuing to search this entire area. Now, this is a homicide investigation, as I mentioned. Uh, EMS was called at around 3:30 this morning to the TKE fraternity house right off of NJIT campus. One victim was taken to University Hospital and has since died from a gunshot wound. Police again still conducting this very active. Investigation. We are not sure if they are looking for one suspect or multiple people at this time. Again, we've been pushed back multiple times. Rutgers University Newark is also very close to NJIT here. They sent out an email to their students asking them to be aware of their surroundings, start walking in pairs today, and also report any suspicious activity. As you can see, this investigation is still very ongoing. Again, one person has died in a shooting at a fraternity house. Right Right off NJIT campus in Newark, Magdalena Doris, CBS 2 News. All right.